Hey, what's going on guys? It's Dimitri Sam. We're back with another video. Today we're going to be going over denim and let's get started. All right, first piece I got for you is this Acne Studios uh, baggy denim. I, that's pretty much what I'll call them. They have this nice flare fit at the bottom. You're going to see on the B-roll. Beautiful plain splatter, amazing fade. Just super, super, super nice denim. They're super baggy though. I wore them for like a month straight and I haven't been able to put as much wear in them uh, as of recently. I have this theory on baggy denim. I think the more baggy your denim is, the more casual it is. And I've just been doing a lot more formal things as of late, but this is an excellent pair of denim. I would never not recommend Acne for denim, and they've been going crazy on their new collection. So if you need one, pick up a pair. I got this in a size 29. If you're interested, the baggy denim does run super big, so just buy a smaller size, similar to Balenciaga. And yeah, moving on to the next one. All right, next piece of denim I got for you is this Acne Studios faded black denim. I wouldn't say it's cropped, but I did kind of self-hem the bottoms, not permanently, which is amazing. I think if you can try to fold in your denim and not fold out, it looks a little bit better that way. But I probably will get this cropped at some point. Super nice denim. Uh, this is a lot more heavier than the last pair you've seen um, in this nice wash black fade. Just amazing. I think Acne's killing it. They have every single type of denim you can ask for. Please, if I didn't reiterate this before, go to Acne. Nice crop fit. I think crop denim is amazing. I think it's pretty slept on. If you can find yourself a pair of denim that's super big and you crop them or like fold them in, I think that's perfect for nice leather shoes and things like that. But yeah, got this in a normal size. So if you're looking for this model, I'll put the uh, number and kind of name above. And let's go. Moving on to the next. All right, next one I got for you is another blue pair of denim. This is the Acne Studios Flare Denim. I'll put the year and model just like I said before. We got these rips on the thigh area, knee area, beautiful fading. I love this blue. Tips for denim, you have to buy it in store or maybe order on Essence so you can return it because denim is tough. Anything that you see online, the color is always gonna be different. But yeah, uh, can't go wrong with this one. I got it in a size 29, way smaller than my normal waist size, but that's all they had and I was able to stretch them with a waist stretcher. Find the link on Amazon. I'll post that uh, in the description below if anybody needs it. But yeah, can't go wrong with this pair of denim. Got this in a size 29 by 33. I believe this was a woman's pair. They had the men's pair, which was way back here, but I really like how this fits. Just amazing. I think you can't go wrong with acne, just like I said before. So go ahead and try to get yourself a pair of acne denim and move it on. All right, next one I got for you is a beauty. This has been worn and washed over the years. It's kind of like my, my project that I always wanted to work on was this Capital Shishisko denim in this blue colorway. Man, when you first get it, it's rough. Like, I can't do denim like that because I have multiple pairs. So I need to make sure that my denim is like nice and soft before wearing. But luckily, I was able to wear this as much as I could to get it to this, the wear and tear that it is now. I got this in a size 33. Remember to size up on these as they do run small. It fits a little bit cropped, but I like it because the way that I style it, it's usually with like heavier boots, like bigger boots, or like a little more flooded type of look with the, the leather sneakers. I think that works amazing with this type of denim. Beautiful blue colorway. They make them in the black and burgundy as well. I just gravitate to more of the lighter side as I do have a decent amount of dark colored denim. And I think pants or denim, you should always try to have multicolored because it just makes it even better. Capital patch here on the side, you have the cinch waist here. Yeah, can't go wrong with capital, just go denim, moving on. Next denim I got for you is this, I was, I was about to say helmet length, but this is a pair of Levi's that I got from Unsound Rags. Beautiful, beautiful color. I only seen this type of style on the helmet length painter jeans, which I did have and I love them, but with those jeans, they're old so they're like from the 1990s i believe and most of the time if you buy a pair they're gonna be like very faded and light which i just didn't like it just didn't go with a lot of my clothes but this is a more darker pair i got from a sound rags like i mentioned earlier which you they're the best for denim if you could get them because they sell out quick go there if you, if you can beautiful ripping down here i did tailor these a lot they are a little bit more slimmer than I would like, but I'm not tailoring them again. They're just done at this point. I love the color. They go good with boots, shoes, uh, anything of that nature, and they're amazing. Brown denim is probably one of the best denim you can find, especially in Levi's. 501 especially. I think this was a, this is actually a 32, 34, because they do shrink, and yeah, you cannot go wrong with Levi's. Moving on. All right, next one I got for you is a staple. This is not as flattering and as crazy as the other ones, but I think a pair of slim 
wash denim you can never go wrong with. Had this pair in my closet for years. I've dyed it black, uh, faded back to gray, dyed it black. Now it's back to this faded gray color. And you can't go wrong. I'll probably get a couple pair of these. I believe everyone should kind of have a summer pair, a uh, baggier pair. And, and, at the end of the day, it's each his own, but for me, I like to have a lot of variety in my closet. Like, however I'm feeling, I want to pull out a pair of denim, and then that's basically me for the day. So yeah, I got this slim pair of denim uh, from Acne. This is previous season, so you got the pink tag over here. I got this in a size 33 because they were very skinny. Washed it down, so now it fits perfectly in my body. Yeah, can't go wrong, slim pair of Acne denim. Moving on. All right, so these last two pairs are up for sale if you're interested. I'm still on the fence about these, but yeah. I have this Acne Studios faded straight leg denim in a size 32 by 34. It fits on the baggier side, which I like. However, I do have a lot of baggy denim and I want to slim it down a little bit. So if you are interested, feel free to let me know. But yeah, can't go wrong. This is like more heavier weight denim, which I do love. Uh, reminds me of like an old pair of Levi's, the way that it's faded and washed out. It's Acne at the end of the day. So if you're down, hit me up. Acne faded washed denim, moving on. All right, last one I got for you is a La Mer piece actually, and this one might be up for sale as well. I'm just debating on whether or not what to do with it, but it is another pair of baggier denim. Super nice brown color. I love it so much. It's very similar to the Levi's I showed you earlier, except it's this more baggier, more cottony kind of feel versus the other pair was a little bit more rough. I got this in women's actually. This is a size 29 waist, but it fits a little whole lot bigger. I washed and dried these and they couldn't get any smaller. So my last resort is tailored them, but I don't know if I want to. So hit me up in the comments if you do need them. Super nice fit, right? Uh, you got a flare at the bottom, you got baggy legs, you got baggy thighs, you got baggier, uh, slimmer waist as it is a women's piece, but you still have enough room right here in the rise. Uh, one pocket back here, two on the sides, black button detail. Can't go wrong with Lemur. I think Lemur is killing it. Check the women's pieces out if you are a man, because they all do run oversized and they look amazing on men. And yeah, moving on. That being said, it's gonna wrap it up for my denims video. Hit me up in the comments. If you need anything, if you're looking to see what size you need, uh, IG is also a good one as well. I appreciate all your support and I'll see you later. Peace. Denim, if you need. Uh, yeah, just describe the denim, bro. Like you're just supposed to be just